Hi, I'm Karen and I'm winging this a little bit, but I hope it all works. Um, I have not quite the setup here at home, so I'm doing the best that I can with the circumstances. Um, I'm here to explain to you who I am, and I am best described in my own idea as a creative artist of life. Um, I've had trouble with putting words on myself um, that felt limiting. So we'll start out with um, visual artist and writer, primarily. Um, but my degree was in related arts, and um, it's more of a way that I approached life. Um, the term creative artist of life was the best English words I could find uh, to fit what I was already doing. And I got those words, the definition and the characteristics of that word, from Hannah Laura Hahn, who was um, the founder of the International Women's Writing Guild. She had been a European Holocaust survivor and came to the United States, and she created the International Women's Writing Guild um, for women to have a place, a community for writing, and also um, for a creative space for women. And um, she brought the term from Germany. The, ger the, the term was Lebenkunstler, L-E-B-E-N-K-U-N-S-T-L-E-R, Lebenkunstler, um, which meant artist of life. And there was no word in the English language for that. Um, let me refer to some of I think making life itself an art um, is very much needed in our society these days uh, because I believe that part of our decaying culture has coming from uh, a factory style life that we've uh, been raised into, created from the industrial age where everything was mass production and it was quantity over quality. Everything had to be organized in quantities and categories, um, which left little for creative life. Um, it's an approach to life where you have the zest and inspiration of an artist, but you may not necessarily be working as an artist, um, where life itself is a canvas and your self-expression is um, something that's necessary regardless of monetary reward. Um, it's an attitude towards life that uh, requires innovations and inspiration, experimentation, and devotion regardless of age. I, myself, um, live somewhat intuitively and, and I've done many different kinds of art. Um, I, my favorite still seems to be like surreal. I've done social activist, uh, social statement kind of paintings and, um, but I've done drawings and just abstract and, um, photorealistic work. Um, so I, and I don't limit uh, my visual expression to painting, although it started with oil painting, um, with the new technology. I've been, um, using my paintings and drawings and bringing them into digital and then working with them on computer as well. Um, and I've done a lot of photography as well. I mainly... My subject matter is basically not one style. I tend to um, 
gravitate to what's in my environment and um, not limit my subject matter. There's more to that with me and how I live, um, but I hope that gives you a beginning and an understanding of of me. You can find me and as Creative Artist of Life on Facebook. Um, I'm just about beginning to be on Instagram. Um, I'm Karen D. There, it's K A R Y E E N D E E. Um, and I'm at Karen D. Fifty Seven WordPress dot com, and I'm at Pixels, um, as my name is Karen Henninger on pixels.com where I do have quite a variety of my visual images there. I've been published and I've um, had awards for my work and I've um, exhibited internationally as well as nationally. And thank you for hanging out with me. Bye.